All right, guys. Uh, sorry, that was a messed up intro, but whatever. Um, welcome to another cartoon pony video. And today I am going to be showing you my new update. Why am I panting? I don't know why. But um, yeah. So here is the shield. It's mostly finished. I may be doing a few add-ons. Maybe one of these. Um, here's the guy. Looking boss, right? So here you can see on the chest, what's this? Well, I had an extra stealth team gun. And the tip of it went on the shield right there. So I turned it into a Dada Doom cannon. I don't know why I named it that. It just sounded cool. It sounds like an orky thing. If you're a Warhammer player. But, um... I also updated the base with um, a hand, a power fist, a shoulder pad, that thingy, that weird boxy thingy, a um, hand controller thingy, um, an arm. Oh yes, uh, one of these thingies, one of those um, smoke dispensers. Um, ah yes, and a las cannon scope right there. Um, and a plasma gun shoulder pad right there, and a shoulder pad right there. So, um, if you take a look at it, it looks super bulky, and this is what I want. Um, reason why is because it's like he just destroyed this mound of space marines, and this is the last guy standing, and he's just like, oh, oh, and he's just quivering from fear as his face gets knocked in by a foot, like the whoa, sorry, like this, and there's this guy just saying, Dada Doom, as he jumps down, I think that's what I'm going to name him, the Dada Doom, I don't know, maybe, um, something, the Lord of Doom, some, yeah, sounds cool, so, um, marker light thingy on the tip of the gun, um, yeah, those guys. And so this is actually just a normal crisis battle suit. But um as you can see barely no you can't see. But um right there his flying stand broke off. I was just painting him earlier today. I was just like, "Wait, hold on. This guy doesn't have a base. Maybe I should go make a base for him at home." And then when I come home, I just take this, uh, I just find my bag of random parts right here, and I take, um, and I take my Predator's auto cannon, and I'm just like, well, I won't be needing this, because my, uh, last cannon's already, uh, glued to it, so I'm like, whoa, I notice that my, uh, plasma gun here, or plasma rifle, has its tip broken off, so I'm just like, wait, this is an opportunity. So I cut off the uh, auto cannon with the uh, clippers here, and I take it off of the uh, tank turret, and I glue it on there. I realize, yes, I have to prime it and all, so I'm going to have to be super careful, uh, especially with the Dada Doom cannon. I don't know why I call it that. It just sounds so cool. And then um, this light sword, I'm planning to leave clear. Uh, you all know what that is, if you've played with any of the models, it's a, um, flying stand, or a stand for a flyer, um, in which case it was a drone, but I didn't need it, um, so taking a closer look at this Space Wolf, uh, he was the, the only Space Marine guy that I had open, because my Dark Angels army was, like, fully painted, and I didn't want to use a model for it, so, um, if you look in there, it really seems like some sort of huge battle has go gone on and like there's so many explosions it's smashed so much stuff together. What I really like about it is it seems like, oh, I'm king of the hill. I can crush your face. Nobody can stop me. Blah ha ha sort of thing, you know? Like where where this tiny little guy with two pistols um walks into this like two platoons of guys with giant machine guns and rocket launchers and he just wrecks them and then there's this giant pile of bodies and stuff right here and um 
then that person's just like, because something happened, and, like they did something, I don't know, something evil. Like maybe they turned him, the guy with the pistols, into a nuisance or monster. I don't know what a nuisance is. I shouldn't be saying that then. But um, anyways, uh, I've been thinking that I'm going to start priming it soon because this is like the pieces that I have left. Um, don't have very many pieces, don't see much stuff that I need to put on, but what I do see is I see some more, uh, weapons or modifications going on to this guy. I mean, the shield looks cool and all, but, um, I think it needs something on these, uh, corners here, or something. I don't know what, but it needs something. And I was thinking maybe I'd do something to the back of, uh, the battle suit. But, um, it will be intact, probably, this whole thing, um, by at least update 10, if I make an update 10. <laughs> um, but, anyways, time to get a closer look at the Dadadoon cannon. It's just a stealth cannon, stealth burst cannon thingy ma bob, whatever you want to call it. But, um, when we're playing non-apocalypse, I'm just going to be counting this as a crisis battle suit with some awesome up upgrades with uh the stuff that it has on it um plasma rifle missile pod and um uh, probably either a flamer or, or that i don't know proxy proxy everyone um but yeah so uh stay tuned for the next update um it's coming along very well and uh i'm very happy with it so um leave a comment if you uh want it if you have any input on what i should make maybe uh you want me to make like a giant titan that my friends is gonna take like maybe a year <laughs> i don't know i i i just like building random pieces like this um so yeah uh stay tuned for the next update thanks